Hello, so here is a quick rundown on OBS. Argopol put a video up um, a couple months ago, I think it was, and it's a basic tutorial on installing OBS, getting it set up, and I'll put the link in the description for that. So here is how I set it up for, uh, for recording Guild Wars 2. So first thing you need to do is you go down here to the scenes box and you're going to add a scene. And I'm just going to call this... I'm just going to leave it as scene 2. And then it's, it's now blank because I switched scenes. Uh, then I'm going to go over here to the sources under scene 2 and I'm going to um, add game capture. I'll just do that here so that you can see. Okay, so we go over here to the sources and we're going to add a source called game capture. And up here I've added monitor capture just so that you can actually see what I'm doing because I'm using OBS to record at the same time as showing you how to use it. I have to make sure that it's actually recording what I'm doing. So I'm going to uh, add, a, add a source that says game capture. And for this, um, it's going to ask for an application. So what we're going to do is we're going to open up Guild Wars 2. And we're going to go into Guild Wars 2 so that the application is actually running. Okay, so it's running now. We're going to hit refresh. It says Guild Wars 2. We're going to leave this checked. Do not check use hotkey. Because if you check use hotkey, then it will turn your scene on or off depending on the hotkey pressing. So you open Guild Wars 2 and you'll be recording, but you won't what? That face, <laughs> it's like, that's just the epic troll face. And so this will turn the scene on or off and it's really confusing. You'll be recording and it'll be black. You don't want to use hotkey, you want to use application. So set that to Guild Wars 2, set that to application and push OK. And so now that I've got game capture, what should happen is if I click on Guild Wars 2 down here, it's going to expand and you're going to see somebody is PMing me on Steam. <laughs> oh, Trey. I think he's the best thing about Guild Wars 2. If Guild Wars 2 had a spirit animal, it would be true fighting. And so I've got my hotkey set to F6, and I'm going to show you how to set that up right now. Okay, so it's minimized. What we need to do is go under uh, settings, and it's in English. We are going to just check all the settings real quick. I've got mine set to 3000. I would recommend 3000 for most people. Uh, 8000 is high definition, and 1500 is low definition. Um, so 3000 is sort of a happy median. Uh, watch your videos after you record, try recording some Zerg footage. If they're choppy, if the frame rate kind of drops, then lower your uh, bit rate. And if it seems fine, then you can raise it as high as you want, as long as you're not getting any lag. This depends on the computer you're using, so um, it's just you're going to have to mess around with that. But 3000 is uh, a nice happy medium that I found. Uh, audio, it should be default AAC. Under broadcast settings, the only thing you're going to want to do here is click on browse, change your uh, video recordings folder to your videos folder, and then change the file save format to mp4, and then leave everything else as default. Uh, for video, leave this as default. Don't use any resolution downscaling unless you have a widescreen computer and you're wanting to downscale it to 
like a normal letterbox or something. Uh, and FPS, higher FPS is generally good. Uh, it can make up for low resolution and make it look better if you use higher FPS but lower resolution. Um, but I would leave that at 30. Audio, uh, make sure that this is set to you know, the audio device that you're using. If you're using a microphone, make sure it's set to your microphone and not to like some uh, audio input on your laptop or something. Uh, hotkeys, make sure that you're this is the only thing that you need to change is under broadcast. Make sure that your start recording and stop recording are the same hotkey. I use F6. You can use the scroll wheel, uh, clicking down the scroll wheel on the mouse, which is easy. Uh, but just be paying attention to whether you're recording or not recording because there's no overlay to give you an indication of whether it's currently recording or not. So be paying attention to when you've started recording and when you've stopped recording and every now and then just minimize to see if OBS is recording or not so that you don't miss footage or be recording like you selling stuff on the trading post. Uh, this should all be the same. Make sure that this is set right here under video is set to very fast and encoding profile is set to high and leave everything else as default and the rest just leave as default. And so uh, hopefully that sets it up and whenever you're done just hit F6, stop recording open file, go to the recordings folder, and it should be recorded in a Windows media format. It should be done recording, which it is. Hello. And, and you, you see it, it's uh, easily viewable in whatever vid video editing software you have. So hopefully this helps you. If you have any questions, just uh, let me know.